dedicato la mia vita ai momenti più felici ad inseguire un sogno il mio sogno quante volte mi hai deluso non importa io ci credo e vivo il mio sogno pari grande amore Bari unica e sola, Bari nel nostro cuore, non ti lasciamo, ti lasciamo da sola, facci sognare ancora. Welcome everyone to a brand new edition of the Staten Island Soccer Report. We might have to drop the camera up a little bit in the studio here. But I'll continue in the meantime. Alongside me, Brian Dorr, and we have George back on the show. Hello, everybody. Welcome, gentlemen. Thank you. Um, again, we're in August, so I don't really think there's much going on. Actually, maybe a tournament or two. I think Brian might there's have a, something to do. There's a bunch going on. There's, tournaments. There's been some tournaments out there. We, um, we just finished a tournament last weekend. We went down to, by we, I say freedom. Uh, we went down to... Westchester, Pennsylvania, and right. we participated in the Westchester Summer Classic sponsored by Penn Fusion and uh, Westchester okay. United. Uh, very nice tournament. Um, first time playing U11. Yep. Okay. So it was a U11 tournament for us. 9v9, nice. all new formation, you know, new players, um, you, you know, adding that additional player. We have new players to the team that were down there. So it was fun. Um, four games. Uh, that, well, that guaranteed three games. Four, okay. First two games, uh, we, we walked away after day two, uh, day one, up, you know, winning our bracket, finishing first. Nice. Um, second day, semifinal early on. Um, and really, what the, forget about everything else. We, went, we yeah. won the semifinals, we, we made it to the finals, you know. Unfortunately, only to lose um, right. on on PKs. Right. However, what what the yeah, story of is, and, and as coaches, we can all say, that yeah. In the first game, the semifinal game, we were down one nothing. Okay. We come back, we tie it up one one, go down two one, tie it up two two, and then from there, they fought back, got it to two two, and then we took off and wind up winning five right. three. Right. So that okay. day, we, we you know the right. resiliency of the team. Yep. Make it to the finals. Down two nothing at the end of the first half. Okay. Come back, tie the game at two two. A... They go ahead three two. We go and come back and tie it three right. three <laughs> to bring it finish out the game to bring it to PKs and, and it went right through PKs. There was no, no five time. minute. I don't no get say, that. Hey, five yeah. minute. Yeah. I get it if we have to go to OT to, to to PKs, but you didn't throw us a five minute say, okay, golden goal, whatever. Right. Yeah, yeah. We went right to PKs. Yeah. Um, and we lost on PKs two to one. It's it, one of those things it's where one you of those just, things. Yeah. it was an experience for the right. girls because at yeah. U nine you they didn't have to go PKs. Well I'm sure the girls were crushed by that. Of course because they Because they fought but back. You, but you wanna know something? But that's they the, were upset. They were crushed. Yeah. But every single one of them walked off the field. Yeah. With their head held high. Okay. And, and, and you know, a couple of, you know, Tia was shed here. But, but it, I think it was just the, the emotional. Of course. You know, they yeah. went back. Right. You know, fought back. They were down. And, yeah. and you've both seen my team play. And, you know, we mm -hmm. all have teams that fall into mm -hmm. kick and chase. Right. I'm not saying this team that we played was better than us. They played a different game. And... It was the kick and chase. They weren't. They, they didn't play possession like we did, and yep. these girls did not stop. Right. They still played their game. They didn't get nervous. They didn't change their way and say we're just going to kick yep. the ball and chase it, and we're going to. They played their game. They passed. They moved. They did overlaps. They did their give and goes, you know, to the point where it created an opportunity, and they came back and they scored. That the coach during the game. Actually, at, just as it ended and went to PKs, he said, what right. a comeback. <laughs> what great. a comeback. Yeah, that's always a great 
And yeah. those are great things yeah, when you yeah. get a compliment from the oh, sure. from the Oh, sure. Absolutely. Right. And that's the way it should be. Mm -hmm. can, I ask, can I ask a question? As a, as a coach also who's uh, right now, our, this is our last season of 77, and you just transitioned from 77. Well, Silver Lake Dolphins, right? The Silver Lake Dolphins. That we are, we're going into... U10 for the first time, obviously, okay. and um, uh, we're going to play 7v7 like you just finished mm -hmm. playing and you just transitioned to 9v9. Can you talk about how that transition has gone it, it, just from the tournament? Uh, I got hit. For my team, it was a little different. It wasn't a straight 7v7 to 9v9 transition. We played our New York Cup, it was 7v7, and any tournaments we played in was 7v7, but our league in Northern Counties was 8v8. Okay. Northern counties didn't change at that time. I gotcha. So it it really wasn't much of a an adjustment in saying, okay, now we're adding two extra bodies onto right. the field. Yeah. For the most part it was adding that one, one extra, extra body. Time. But with that, you're coming with a formation change. Of course. Yeah. You know, it, you can make it easy. We I went from a a a, a three, you know, a three three one playing eight v eight, right? To now a three two three. Mm -hmm. So I'm at, you know, I'm adding two midfielders, giving them the roles of, you know, they're they're both considered center midfielders, right. but I'm giving them the role of you're more my my defensive midfielder, you're my attacking midfielder, right. and just learning to do that, and it's it's an adjustment. Um, it's more once they get on the field. They're playing. Right. They just need to know to make sure to keep their lines, to do all... Well, that's the but big one. That's it, the big thing. Is are they still they're keeping their lines all of a sudden? That's why I recommend to you, and I learned this after the fact, or else I would have played a couple more tournaments in the summer. I found out from talking to a friend of mine whose daughter was transitioning from U10 to U11. Over the summer, <clears throat> those where most, you know, you'll play your select tournaments mm -hmm. or the summer tournaments. So instead of they played as a team, they went in as U11 the lowest bracket. Mm -hmm. So they played yeah. U11, two, three tournaments, U11, lowest bracket, with no intention of, hey, if we win, we win, if right. we win. But it was there to introduce the kids to the new to formation. 9v9, right. new formation. Right. This is how we're going to play. This is how we're going to practice. Had I known that and thought about that, I would have done the same thing. Instead, that's what this tournament right. was. This tournament was us to get in there, Let's see what happens. Right, oh. and it, it worked out. We played some. Well, tough you did teams. pretty good. We played yeah. some, you know, physical teams, and they played well. And right. they and it it gave me what I wanted. It gave us an opportunity to see them play, yeah. in that formation. Right, and make adjustments as we need to. I don't get why they eliminate the overtime, the the extra time after the. Yeah, I, I, I don't get why they do it. Tournament wise, John, oh. it's it's more t time constraint. It's let's get it done, let's right. get it over right. with. It shouldn't be that way because, again, your girls fought back twice, right. two different right. games. And, and who, we scored the last goal to tie it. Who's to say that our to, momentum you know, doesn't carry us you know. a little bit? But it is what it is. Yeah, yeah. You, could have easily, you could have easily been on the other side of that, resolved right. at the PKs and say, but, hey, that's you know, right. I, we didn't echo, have a chance. To echo again, what it, the other coach said to me, not that I agree with his resolution at the end, but it was – Give us five, ten minutes to play. If we finish tied at the end of that, yeah. you know what? Split it. I don't necessarily agree No, with no, that. no. Then you go but to the PK. Give us a chance yeah. to do it. Otherwise, it's, yeah. you know, go and play. Here you go. Now it's pick your five kids. And we went to six rounds. Right. Okay. Wow. So you went an extra round. Go, was oh, it go. three? Was it three rounds to begin with? Was no, it five? five? It was five. Because some of them do you three, know. right? Yeah, some of them right, do right, three, but right, ours were five. Right, right. Okay. You know, their goalie, some of my girls. You know, I had one girl who yeah. was deathly afraid okay. of taking PKs, mm -hmm. you know, for the longest yeah, time, even right. if we were going to do PKs in practice. Right. And it was, it, running a lap was on the line. I don't want to take it. I don't want to yeah. take it. Yeah. Don't, I don't want to take it. I said, you're going second. <laughs> Stepped up and took it. All right. So, you know what? To me, that kid overcame something. Right. And then I had some other girls that were new. That yeah. I had one of my yeah. newer girls. She was new team, new to the team. First game she's playing with us. I said, you yeah, know, here you go, take a shot. Yeah, and yeah. I had six girls do it. We scored one. One girl put it off the po off the crossbar. A couple of them were right at the. But you know what? They're nervous. Yeah, it like, takes a special type of. And like, and, it's, and hard. Like, it's hard. It's hard. And and, and yeah. like I said to them when they came, one of the girls who came, actually the girl who took the last shot, um, she took it and. and 
I could see she was visibly upset, and I said to her, yeah. "It's not. It, it 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 takes a lot more courage to step up and do what you did, right? Yeah. Than to stand on the sideline and watch and criticize, right. That you missed it, or you could have done this, you could have done that. Right. Next time you're going to be in that situation, it, it's going to be familiar for it you. It takes. It, it's. It, it's the person that stands up in the arena yeah. and takes that shot. Right. Just that's in the, just in so general, cool. I think just in general. You have to have that killer instinct, you know. You have to want to take it. Step in the right. You got to, and, and just nail it somewhere. You have just, to want don't it. even think about it. Just, just go up right. there. But remember, some a lot of these girls when they know first where you want to go with it. Yeah. Know right. where you want to go with it, but just do it. Just don't right. think you want it. Don't think about it. Right. But it's like anything. Like the game slows down. Do you do you if practice that? Do you practice? To be honest games? with you, we never did. Be, All right. at, and you, at you know, U nine, U ten. Well, it, you're not really you're not focusing on that. Right. Yeah. Now I can tell you this right now. It's not that it's going to become something right. that we oh every practice is ending right. on right. PK, but there'll be a point where okay mm -hmm. this is what listen this is what you want to do here's your right. picking and that's right. it. Right. But it'll be done so that you know oh you're going you're going. Just prepare no, yourself just prepare for when right before a tournament. That's all. Right. That's basically that's all you got to do. You could even do it as a pre-practice yeah. like yeah. fun right. session. Right. Hey, shoot around. Hey, everybody shoot right. from that right. line. Thankfully, I was, your season games don't go into extra time. No. Okay. They end on a tie, which right. is a good thing. Which right. is, that, is it, exactly it. You right. don't want... No. You know, no, time is over. Time is over. That. That. There's right. plenty of time for that. Right. It's a Leading up, learning experience, and that's what it is. Right. Leading up... We're, yeah. uh, that was yeah. it for the tournament. Um, and now we're getting ready. Now it starts, you know... Preseason, we're, we're actually probably having. I confirmed it. It sounds as if it's confirmed. We have a friendly in two weeks. Okay. A week from this Thursday, we'll have a friendly. Right. I'm trying to think. Yes. Yeah, so a week from this, we'll have a friendly with another Staten Island team. Um, just to get the kids to play. Just why not? And then why not? we start our season in the second week weekend in September. September. September after September Labor Day. 9th is that 10th? the 10th? We start, yeah. our week, Ten. Uh, we start our season. The week, same thing. The let's, week after. Uh, let's touch on your team a little bit, George. Well, we just, uh, well, um, yeah, we took a long time off this summer um, right. for very, you know, coaching right. availability training mm -hmm. we weren't able to do. But um, I don't know if I mentioned in the last week's show, we, we took on an, uh, another coach. Yeah. A, a high, a very high level coach. Okay. Which, a lot, which who has a lot more time to dedicate to, to practices in the summer. Very important, right? Uh, tremendously, because yeah. now we were now we are we were able to have regular practices. Yep. So we're having them Sundays. Yeah. We're, we're starting to slowly get back into the regular Tuesday, Thursday routine. And he's okay. able to take the girls and, and run with it when Ernest isn't there. Right. Um, and they've even already had a uh, joint session together, and probably tomorrow will be another joint session. Okay. So um, we're starting to get back into the momentum. Kids are still away. Um, which is understandable. We didn't give them a big plan, but uh, for next season, um, we're going to have our meeting right before the season starts, one of the practices, and uh, we're going to kind of lay out the plan for the year, a lot more, uh, a lot more predictable than uh, as to what we want to do. Right. Then you know you have your standards: uh, fall, yeah. spring, season, uh, winter, whatever it is. But we want to do more of the Coliseum tournaments mm -hmm. indoors. We've already discussed it, that we definitely want to do more of those. All right. um, we're gonna do the Columbus Day tournament. We're gonna to do the obviously Memorial Day tournament. Maybe throw a, a, a kickoff there, either a kickoff to the spring, and or um, a season end there somewhere in at the end of June after the season ends. Right. Uh, that depends on the parents. It's, that's right. totally option. Right. Uh, we're gonna do the futsal league indoors as well, okay. which is well, all the parents are happy about that. We don't have to go off island, and right. it's a good it's, right. and it's a good tournament, a good thing for us. Um, I mean, where's coaches? What's the age? How far does that go? That futsal. I don't know. <laughs> we gotta get Excuse we gotta get Ernest uh, on here. I think they they go. I've seen twelve and I think you eleven, twelve. That's it? I think yeah. I've seen thirteen. Mm -hmm. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. But um, I think the parents, some of the parents, have seen some of the practices with some of the newer girls that are yeah. on the team. Yeah. And the fact that we have two great coaches, trainers. Um, we're excited to get right. started. Some of the new girls are, are, tr are tremendous. Just gonna say that you guys must. You sound like you're excited. I, we can't yeah, wait. Yeah. We can't wait. I was, you know, I want to go on my vacation. And we, yeah, but yeah, we want to come yeah. back. We want to see them tested yeah. already. Yeah. Okay. So, so I think yeah. we haven't had the full team yet at practice, but yeah. the, but we will. Well, that's September the hard part. Of, right. That's the hard part of the summer. You get half yep. and half. Yeah. Free mm -hmm. quarters. Right. You know. But so hey, we're with 14 girls and playing seven v seven. 
th- even three quarters. We have three quarters yeah. game ready, right. season ready girls. It's still, okay. and everybody yeah. else will will catch up quick. That's that's not a problem. So where are you playing in the northern uh, counties? Northern, okay. we're, we're back to northern counties, but we're going into the D division. We moved up from mm-hmm. E. Okay. Um, we're going to see how we do in the spring, in the fall, right. and then um, hopefully go to C if, if we do well enough to do that. I think we should be able to, but okay. we're going in the other direction from Brian. We were played eight v eight. Now we're going down to seven v seven, um, but which is fine. It opens up the field for us. We have a couple. Okay. Uh, we have a we have a bunch of very fast girls. Right. So that extra space actually will help them. You'll okay. be surprised. It, it, it now that they've got up there. Now they're a little older, a little bigger. You, you think that it opens up more space? Mm-hmm. It, it's. <laughs> You're still going to be. It's it's a different game, different atmosphere. But it's well, we were well, we were exposed to it in Amanalpin, and as a matter of fact, the, we those the season we played, we played. All right, guys, with, with looks like we're getting a Vincenzo. phone call. It uh, might be uh, Vincenzo. Vincenzo, are you on the line? Hey, Johnny. Hey, there he is. Hey. hey. Okay, Vincenzo, we got Brian back tonight. Hey, Vincenzo. And we got George. All right, so we got a full house today. Uh, you know, everybody involved, Vincenzo. We just want to, you know, talk about the game, and you know, and go from there. So, what's going on, Vincenzo? Anything? Yes. Wow. What was the score, Vin? 2 nothing. Wow. Uh, but at those games, you know, I still believe, even though they, they, they mentioned Super Cup, this and that, I still uh, they're not in top condition, top form yet. Well, uh, they better get in top form quick. <laughs> now, let me ask you, Vincenzo, was Juventus playing with the filled squad? They didn't take it yeah. serious then. That's they all. don't take, you know, yeah. but uh, those, I guess those three pre-season games, Johnny, even though they put the uh, Invitation Cup, the Super Cup, right, this, right, that, right. I mm-hmm. don't, uh, well, it's still a game, but not the, the real game where everybody goes out 100%. You know, Vincenzo, what I'm tired of hearing is this classic, uh, classic, uh, the classic. Oh, oh, man. Would you stop already with this already? How many times are you going to have it? You know, th- that should be done once, the classic. One time. You play that big game. You can't hype it up all the time. You know, they just had a game yesterday, right? Yeah, but that, yeah, yeah. they, I didn't even know that that was on. I happened to stumble upon it right. yesterday. Right. That it was, oh, the. Yeah. Yeah. Spanish Super Cup, but now is this a whole new like now? A Super Cup is a new Super thing. Cup, it's a new thing. The Italian Super Cup. Right, right. Spanish Super Cup. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. So what they're doing, uh, they're doing it's a two legged. Yeah. Of the, of the, uh, the season, I guess. The Juventus Scudetto mm-hmm. right. and the Juventus Cup. Right. And the winner of the Italian Cup, right. which was Lazio. Coppa Italia. Coppa Italia. Right. The Coppa Italia right. Against uh, the first place team. Yeah, and they play like the Super Cup. Yeah. But I guess uh, for the fan, maybe, but uh, for the really a true soccer fan who loves to watch a real game, yeah. I don't think it's a hundred percent productivity. Yeah, well, I can yeah. tell you yesterday that that Spanish Super Cup, they they had their players playing. I mean, yeah, except Suarez for uh, Cristiano didn't well, start. Right, right, he didn't start. Suarez Normally, was right, 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 right. Okay. You know, well, somebody got suspended in that cup. Well, Ronaldo. we're gonna talk about that now. So, what do you think now, Vincenzo? You know, he's one of the biggest or maybe the best player in the world, right? Okay, right? Listen, right? You can argue, you to, right, right? You could probably argue all day long. He's the best player in the world, and he went out onto the field while everybody's watching, and he put his hand on an official. Okay, he, he pushed a referee. What's your thoughts on that, Vincenzo? Well, I don't care if you're a family, if you're a Maradona, if you're the super best, you cannot push a hand on the referee. There you go. There you go. And he got five uh, games. He got suspended. The they should set up a good example, especially when the superstar does. That means no, oh, super, that means anybody could do it. Exactly, exactly. Five weeks suspension. Maybe, I don't know, if it's enough, but because, uh, 
that whatever you touch a referee, what is the intention? Do you, do you mean to hurt the referee? It was an accidental touch? I mean, uh, it didn't look accidental didn't. to me. But see, to me, do you to do his it, credit. Do you make the point and do yeah. it? Now, I don't know in soccer, he suspended five matches, right? Right, five matches. Five well, matches. Four for the push, right. one, one for the card. But is it paid? We don't know. That wasn't that even that discussed. I, so to me, you yeah. want to you want to yeah. set the example. Yep. Yeah. It's it, it's a it's a fine. It's a fine. It, it's you're suspended and you lose game day yeah, privileges. Well, 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 speaking about being paid, yeah. Well, I don't think you should be paid. Right. If that's no. Right. But again, especially a superstar, but this guy makes up millions and millions of dollars. Yeah. You did that. Yeah. Right. Over a whatever. What? The suspension, and the fine, and the fine will go to some charity. Exactly. Yes. Let his let his pay for the next five weeks right. go to a charity. Right. That's, That's fine. Exactly it. But you know, you know, and again, I'm not a really big fan of his because of his showboating and stuff. That's the reason why I'm not really a big fan of it. But and it didn't look like it was in. It looked like it was a little touch in the back. I, regardless, you can't. It didn't look like it was something. It wasn't like he yeah, punched it looked, him. It wasn't like right. He, no, but he it looked intentional. Right. He did push yeah. him. He it went it like this. It was a one-handed little. It was. A, it no, he was frustrated because he thought it right. was a wrong right. record. Now let's right. not forget. Now and he got. Not, he thought he got tripped that. in the box. Right. He's expecting a PK. He doesn't Didn't get it. Didn't go his way. No, right. but he gets so, a yellow for for diving. Is it a first-time offense, Vincenzo? First-time yeah. offense. No, no, you got to take all that into consideration, also. No, no, Ken, it doesn't matter. Uh, you touch that really, I don't care if it's the first time or the hundred time. All right, I, I can't. I won't argue. And I I won't argue that either. I won't argue that. But has he been doing it? Oh, you know, is it, is it the first time he's done this? Uh, John, to be honest, if if I have to put a dollar bet, I I think it might be the first time he touched a referee. Right, right. Okay. But but like we talked about before the show, all the all the plays do. But especially the superstars, yeah. they get in the face yeah. of the ref and yeah. they and they talk down to them. They do. They treat them yeah. like crap. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, maybe they should uh, start suspending or fining these guys even more, you know. Uh, well, uh, that, uh, what else uh, could you do? Hit him in the pocket. That's all you uh, can do. Anybody, you want to hurt somebody, touch that pocket. Yeah, right. Uh, right. but but a guy like him, he probably it won't even affect him. He won't even uh, care. Uh, well, that means, uh, guess what? Let him he sit. Suavez uh, took a bite out of uh, Chiellini, and he got nine games for that. international. But still, FIFA, no. FIFA, 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 right. right. Yeah. FIFA is FIFA now. All right, FIFA find them. Even, uh, again, and I don't even think the nine games was enough. He took a yeah. bite. Even in, in the, uh, ridiculous. Uh, That's ridiculous. Yeah, I was watching that like the MLS. Yeah. The, the famous Kaka. Remember Kaka? Right, right. Well, no, well, I'm glad you brought that up. Did you see the thing with Kaka? Yeah. Yes. In Orlando? I think That was, was right. yep. That I, was a mistake. Yeah, but but he was. They, they were kidding. Uh, they, but who? It's not up to the ref to decide. No, no, of course not. Of course not. Yep. If they are best friends, right, yep. which they are, right, and they were former teammates, mm -hmm. it's not up to the ref to determine right. you were doing that <coughs> as a joke. All the ref sees is there's a skirmish going on. That's he right. turns and sees, and Kaka grabs the guy, grabs by Colin face. by his face. From the back, yeah. Right. I know he was ch covering his mouth and doing it, yep. but the ref doesn't know that. And the, they said it on, on the broadcast, the letter of the law yep. is if you put hands on somebody's face. Now, they may they may need to change that with intent to... And, yeah, but how do you interpret? Then you got to go into how do you interpret intent? Yeah, right. intent. Did, I, discretion. Again, it's going to be the referee's discretion. I get it. Yeah. Well, it was a bad, bad decision. Right. Mm -hmm. But it's not his job to determine that. Right. You were joking no, of out. course not. Right. All right, Vincenzo. So we had a couple bad things going on. You know, Kaká's another famous top player. Right. He he might not be now, but he was. And if and if it wasn't Colin, it, when Colin turned around, and if it wasn't Kaká. Who's he was to say he doesn't punch that guy. He was in the looking face. to start to swing. He was right. starting. Right. He was the only right. reason yeah. he stopped is when he turned around and saw it was him. Yeah. Then his smile. Right. At right. first he didn't smile. He didn't yeah. a little angry, and right. then it smiled. Right. But he was turning around with the, with, with the intent of getting. And into how does the referee it. know who's friends, who's not right. friends? So people who right. were friends yesterday, you don't know. So that. Vincenzo, Vincenzo. Yeah, Vincenzo. Well, no, not anymore because now they got the now they got the cameras. Okay, now that now the referee just puts the sign of the box out. 
and, and they go to the camera. Yeah. But, the what, but, like but the best call of sports. wasn't there a mistake also on a videotape that they, they made a mistake on a call and they went back to the video? It was still, they still didn't get it right. Well, oh, the, the, was it the penalty? About the a week ago. All oh, right. Was a was so, so, so they need to maybe train better training, you know, when Somebody's watching. Be able to pick it out. All right. So, anyhow, Vincenzo, it's pretty sad going into a new season here, at least on the European side. And we have two superstars that were red carded. One, one got suspended. Uh, uh, Jenny, uh, you're asking for it. Especially superstars, they're supposed to set up a good example for the kids, for the fans. Everybody's yeah. watching TV. Yeah. Where before, I remember in the 50s, you had no uh, 40,000 40, television around. You, you only had the referee. And one yep. Yep. Now, you know, if you if you put your on somebody, yeah. they know who did it. And that's how and that's how it should be. You know, let them go back to the videotape and uh, let's try and get the calls right. Mm-hmm. Let's get them right. Yeah, you're right. I don't feel sorry for these guys. No, no, you, you can't. can't no. Feel sorry for them. No, it's kind. Of, it's just, it's sad to see because we you know a lot of young kids are, are watching them. Okay, <laughs> especially the pretty boy, Ronaldo. Right. Especially right. him. You know what he did? It, it's a, it's really a disgrace. Just it really in a way, is. In a way, it's a, you know. I'm happy that it happened now. It, you know, before the season. I don't think it's, season. I don't think it's good if it happens at any time, Vincenzo. We don't I need. We, I understand and what you're saying. Club, you know, punish my superstar now. Listen, well, that's a, that's, a, yeah, that's a fear of the manager of that club. Right. But, but We're regardless. Not we got, but, that, I saw, but I saw somewhere today that either that, that team, even without him on the on the field, they, they got a pretty decent record. Yeah, no, so yeah, they, yeah. They don't. I mean, yeah. he's definitely a top player yeah. in the world, but he's not. Right. That, that's they don't. Like, that, that, the team that they don't drop off as much as they do when, when, when somebody else. That is team. No. That team went. You know, let's forget about that. They wanted the best in the world. You take yeah. Cristiano Ronaldo off the team. You still got Gareth Bale. Yeah. yeah who, yeah. in his own regard. Could be the leader of a team. Right. Of any you know, team. You got Marcelo in the back. You, you, you know. Well, that's why Neymar left, right? Neymar, well, he, well, he Neymar wanted to be. Neymar wanted to be the man, yeah. the and man, now, and, and now he's got to prove he's the man. And he will. I think well, he will. Let's see. Listen, let's he scored see. a goal already in an assist in his first game. He had a good. It. But listen, I understand what you're saying. He's got to prove it, right? Now you got to prove. But it. you give him credit because he of wanted course. to be the that's man. Right. right. That's right. How many guys or women do you know? Listen, he. He moved on. That's that's soccer. Yeah. He was in a shadow for a long time. That's yeah. soccer in a, in, yeah. a, in a nutshell. Yeah, that's they, right. they come in, they just transfer. They're yeah. not. Yeah. He had to pay twenty. I think it was twenty million euro so, to buy himself out. Okay. So he, well, he, he didn't just say, "I want to transfer," right, and right. it's what team's willing to pay for me. Okay. He had to buy his way out of his contract. So you know that shows you how he how much wanted, he, he wanted. He did him. what he did. Right. And right, he right. got what he needed. Right. He learned what he needed to learn. He matured. Uh, all right. Okay. I think we might have lost Vincenzo. That's all right. If he calls back, uh, you know, we'll get him. If not, we'll. But now, uh, so we were jumping around with the pros because Vincenzo came on here, but we both, yeah. you know, filled in. Now uh, your turn to get on the hot seat exactly. a little bit. And, and well, there's re- in the good thing. On. The good thing to this point, there's really not much to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> That's the good. That's not thing. such a good thing. <laughs> yeah, it is you because have a lot of training going exactly. on. Exactly. Well, we had a couple. Three of, days we a had week at least. Yeah, right. You've been attacking well, the two of us. Now was going to be. Wait a minute. You you were you're a proponent of three days a week. I knew this was coming. But uh, anyway, two. Give me two. Day, give me you getting two days in. I got well. I got two days scheduled, but okay. if we're gonna get him in this week, we don't know. No, you, gotta, you know, you got weather we got, we got, we got. Yeah, this happen. weekend we might have some rain on Saturday. I think, but we got, a, we got one coming up on Thursday. Again, with the strike is not really much. I mean, I like what I see so far. Not a full team like you guys. Just you know, like George, you mentioned a few minutes ago. But last week we had about. I think 12 out of, you know, 12. So that's a good, that was a good show. And we did, we did some good work. I don't have my trainer yet. I'm going to have him in a couple of weeks, hope, right? So once he gets in, it'll be even better. And again, not much really. We're going to, the season's actually been pushed back to uh, September 17th, which gives me an extra week. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I like that. The, The bad part about that is we end December 3rd. Oh. We're going into December. Oh, okay. Where it might be, you know, who knows what the weather is in December. But, again, they have to play in that weather also. Right. Meaning the opponent. Right. The other team has to play in that weather. So, we're playing, eight or we're ten. playing ten. ten. And uh, we're in the premier 
Division Most one, U15. Right. Most premier. Well, they have division There's only two. Premier. All right, we might have Vincenzo back, and we'll continue this in a, in a second. Yep. It makes it perfect. Exactly. All right, Vincenzo, thank you for the call, and uh, thanks for the info. Good luck, you guys. Uh, take care. Thanks, Ciao. Vincenzo. Take care. Ciao. Do want to mention before I forget. All right, let's, we'll do it after we, we get into the pros. But again, yet yeah, uh, the premier, there's only two divisions. There's a premier and there's a higher division. I think most of those premier is the higher one, and it goes one through five after that. Right, so but, know, but we're, in, we're in that division, right. the U15, obviously, because right. we're mixed. We've got some old threes and old fours. Right. Um, other than that, this, this, the schedule's out. There's no times and, and, right. and locations right. now yet. Now you got to talk to the coach and right. see what's in. Right. right. No, so I think most of the schedules are out, too. No, you have to do it yourself. Most, I don't well, know. They probably, schedule, have they they have probably schedule it out and say, this is the team you're playing on this right. weekend, this weekend, right. this weekend. But now it's you guys need to work out a time. Yeah. That's how it – see, I'm used to what – you know, if I didn't do New York Cup, I wouldn't be used to talking to you. Right. Know, yeah. You guys for Northern County, when you, they get it out there, this is the date and the time. And so just to wrap up with the, you know, with the strikers, the Staten Island Soccer Club strikers, again, um, I'm happy with everything that's going on, which you know, is very early. Right. But uh, um, seeing some good things from the players that I've seen so far. Good. And of course, things that we need to work on. Of course, obviously. You always right? have things to work yeah, on. Yeah, right. If Otherwise, you don't have anything to work on. There's, there's definitely, you know, some things. But again, we have a core coming in already. There's, there's, there's like, I guess, seven, okay. seven players that have played together already. Okay. All right. So they're already coming in together, which is a good thing. And then my job is to get everybody else going, hopefully. Certainly. And, right. and, uh, well, that's and, and that's it. You know. We'll uh, we'll talk more about it as the weeks go on. Mm-hmm. You know, we're, all our games are in Jersey. Right. Okay. All right. That's, I guess, the way they work it right. there. Right. All the games. Yeah. Are most of course, it's Mammoth Ocean, and you know that. Right. The, the one of the I think you know this better than I do. I always just from talking to people. One of the things they'll let Staten Island teams play, but right. We all got to go. We want you yeah. to play. But your home you team, was, a home but your home team would be Old Bridge, either Old Bridge or. Uh, uh, Old Bridge High School, or there's uh, another field, okay. which is like 40 minutes. Nah, you know, still, that's the, but that's the that's the thing yeah. they want. You gotta, but you gotta be in Jersey. We're not yeah. traveling over the bridge. Correct. I was told, you know, right. I, w- I was also told that if a coach from Jersey agrees to come out here, that's right, and play under the lights right. one night, yeah, they're more than welcome. Right, we, and, we, and we used right. to, we did that, so. we did that occasionally. So. If the other team needed yeah. a replay, they couldn't play yeah. the schedule. Right, game. then you want us. Oh, right. Now it's a little. You want us to help out. So if anybody from the Strikers is watching, you know. Know, shout out to the strikers out there, but uh, again, just looking nothing but uh, good things. Hopefully, you know, sky's the limit. And uh, again, I'm just a piece. We spoke about this. I'm just a piece of this puzzle, right? And a small piece. I'm not. I'm not. I'm, I'm not the big piece. I'm not. I need help. Play, parents, you know, players, uh, assistants, trainer. So it's all got to come right. together. And, but let me t- and I shared this with George once before too. It's you are a big piece. Don't, okay. But the point, the reason I say you're a big piece is because you set the tone. Right. You set the expectations. Right. And, and not just of yourself and your assistant coaches and your trainer, but of the players right. and of the parents. You, you are that big piece. You determine what your philosophy is. You're playing your philosophy. This is what you right. believe right. and what you think is best for your team. And you need to get them to join to in, join in. Right. And, and, and not even join in, buy in. Buy in, exactly. Because it's nothing worse than dealing with, and, and forget about the kids, their kids, and you know, one minute they're in, one minute they're out. Right. It's, you really not need to get the parents to buy in because you got to be able to know. Well, the commitment we need from them. But, is, but you, you also know. need them to buy into your right. Right your philosophy or what you're trying to do and what your goals are for the team because once they leave the field yep you don't yeah. see them yeah. for a couple of days yeah. you're not in there right. here. and I'll, I'll touch and you, on you uh, need to have that parent that buys uh, into you and right. hey listen you should be practicing you should right. this or you know if it, I'll remember, touch team weight teamwork this and team because if you have parents that are at home yeah. And just telling yeah. you to go about your business yeah. and do what you yeah. want to do, what's best for you. Well, let's see what happens with that. Let's see what happens. You, um, you are the big piece. Don't sell yourself. Well, short. I'm not really. I'm just trying to fit in. What I just want it to be. Well, I stress team. We're all going to do things as a team here. You know. Mm-hmm. Right. You know. I noticed the first practice that there was 
two separate groups. And I says, well, you know, you guys have to get together. Right. You know, get, and I know they know, know each other real, but I says, you know what, just we got to have this together. One, right. we're all one here. Right. Okay. So, but um, I'll, I'll touch on the, the girls that go into high school. You know, a number of them trying out. There's or? a there's a few of them, and okay. good luck to them. You know, if they make the high school team, and that was part of the deal. You know, if you got to go to your high school practices. If you can make my practice, great. You know, nice. we can't. High school comes first. But they'll come to my games. My games are all on. Our games are all on Sunday. Right. Doesn't conflict with the high school game. So, so that's a good thing. Right. All right. And 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 going back to uh, big cog, little cog. I mean, there are, there are coaches that take the the approach of they have to be the loudest voice in the yeah. room, yeah. the biggest personality yeah. on the right. team. I, I and don't. Can, and and you know, you better be perfect in that condition because then the, then if you're off by a little bit, I get I get what there. Brian is saying. I understand that, and I just don't want to be that big. The big but that's, what I'm, like that's that. what I'm saying. I, I don't want to be that. I want right. to be I, like kind of the you leader. Still, you could direct. The leader. Right. You could direct. Going to be the leader. Right. But part of the team type, right. you know? Well, you, like could, that. you could steer. So. You could make little suggestions right. to kind right. of steer the steer And the bottom ship line, listen, well, pushing it. at the end of the day, it's fun. We're going to have fun. Right. We're going to have fun. You're going to lose games, right? You're going to win them, and right. you're going to lose them. But just be again, you like you. you Hopefully, my we'll learn. Is be open with the parents. Sometimes it's yeah. oh, sometimes yeah. you oh, yeah. you're you too out. open, but but it doesn't matter. We're gonna you, do a Columbus Day tournament. Right. I want to go to the Teaneck. Mm -hmm. I want to do that, and maybe we could even split the team. Have the the U15s play U15s. Right. And the U. It's because right. Because of the the smaller field, you can do you right. get away with that. Right. A little we bit. could right. we could probably split the team up that way and be great, right? Mm -hmm. Right. So we're looking forward to that. That's good. All right. But you also make that decision because sometimes a, a couple of 15s and a couple of 14 year olds could play right. better together. Yeah. Right. Well, it depends. You, you may well, to well, let's see how. Yeah, let's see how the season goes. Yeah, yeah. just we'll see how no, the season listen, goes. You got to play it out. You don't like you said. You wish the girls luck. You don't know if they're gonna make the teams. If they don't, right. if they, if for some reason they don't make the teams and yeah. they're playing, right. then you don't have no worries. Right. If they don't, listen. You laid out. The I'm sure. I'm sure there. there's gonna be a couple that are gonna be playing high school. Okay. And maybe all of them. Whoever tries out, let them play. But that's what it's all about. You're getting these girls ready to play be able to compete and play in high school sports whether right. it's yep. whether it's soccer whether it's yeah, whatever football, it is yeah. whether it's but yeah. to compete that's right. what it's all about that that's it you're going to yeah. do that and you go from there and yeah, we spoke on this show many times about stretching out all right and this is another i mean how how much can we do with this mm -hmm. stretching stuff but uh all right i think we covered pretty much uh we got about 20 minutes to go on on professional yeah. sports you want to start with uh, you know what we could touch on, on the men's team, that won that gold cup. And we can also touch on the women's side too. So any thoughts on the men's uh, winning of the uh, the gold cup? I was, I was impressed because Bruce Arena did again what he always does. All right. Um, but I'm more impressed he did it with a number of MLS players. Yep. And he did it with a Young. different group mm -hmm. of players. Um, he didn't just do it with yep. his, you know, he went to his bench and he had he still had his Michael Bradley, yep. but he gave the younger kids their chance. And then when it came time that Demi come on up, right? you know, Dempsey got called Well, the young up. guys, it seems like they got him through the uh, knockout stage. Right. They and got him to that point and then he went with... This is where, this, this is where yeah. I, need, he, yeah. I, I need the veteran right. to yeah. come in and play. Right, because he really wanted to win that thing, right? You're at home. You're playing on this. Yeah, on, your, on your right. You got to win that thing, right? Absolutely. So, and against Jamaica, no, again, no disrespect to Jamaica, but you got to beat that team. Oh, yeah. They beat us uh, a few years ago, right? In, yeah. in, in, in the semifinal, they knocked us out. So, no, all right. They, they have to beat that team. Um, what was they didn't the even qualify before? for the World Cup. You got to beat no. it. Any country that doesn't qualify for a World Cup, and you're playing them in a tournament, you got to beat them. At home. Yeah. At Absolutely. home, yeah, you got it. There's no, there's right. no way around it. So, but it was listen. It, it definitely is a change from when, yeah, you know, Clinton was Clinton. there. Yep. But again, it's not the right way. It's not the wrong way. It's a different way. Klinsman had his his philosophy. Yep. And unfortunately for him, yeah. the United States, U.S. soccer, as much as they said we buy in, we buy, right. they didn't buy in. Yep. And he tried to go his way because, if you notice, there wasn't a lot of those European players. No, of course not. I mean, yes, yeah, he be. had Pulisic back, not this tournament, but the tournament. But he still had those. But there was mm -hmm. the, the, the ones he was bringing I, over. I, 
He wasn't bringing them all back from overseas to play. Right. I think he yeah, said it. He said wrong. it before the tournament started. He was going to use MLS players. He said it. So, and that's right. what he did. And that's what he did. Yeah. And, and you that's know what? That's what they did. Right. And they did it with, you know, U.S. born. Right. Soccer. They grew up playing in the U.S. I mean, a couple of, yes, they did go overseas early right. on before. Right, right. But they, they made their bones. But they're playing the here. Right. All right, so but they still have a lot of work to do as far as the qualifying, right? Yeah, they're, like they're not done sitting yet. in third place, which I think gives them a playoff round or something. The third place, I know the top two the automatic top two automatically go, and then the third place has to play, play so somebody like, else. Right, so that's not but where you want to be. Sh- but they have a shot if they right. keep playing right. the way they've right. been playing. Yeah, well, out the door, out the door, and you, now you got Dempsey off the bench, right? And you he's got, just, and he's a beast too. He's still, and then, and he's then still going. The addition of um, what's his name? Dom Dwyer. Dwyer, okay, yeah. You still, know, he, still he, a lot of young. He uh, became he became a U.S. citizen, and no sooner yeah. he become a U.S. citizen, he was they, they pulled him right. right you know, the called him. Fruits Arena called him right up. Yeah. So let's go, give it a shot, and he had some goals. He did his thing. How much do you think that Bruce Arena, being an American, has to do with him pulling like these players, like you said, American players? What do you think? I mean, no. just because he's an American, I, I just more passion, a, he, more passion for the, for the game. You know here. I, I hate doing it this way, but it's the same thing. It's it, just to bring it up. It's like Herb Brooks from from the eighty Olympic right the hockey. hockey team. Yeah, right, you know, yeah. you don't have somebody, uh, you don't have a German standing in front of yep. you saying, "We're going to do it right. for our country." We're mm-hmm. not, it's not no, his country. It's not, yeah, exactly, it resonates. It. Perhaps it resonates. So, well. so, so that being said, should it be a rule that national team coaches have to be from that country? No. No. Well, you, like you just said, you know, I, you got a Brazilian I, guy, uh, you know, in China somewhere. Yeah, but if you bring something, or in table, Canada, or, or in guy, Canada. Right? I think it's still got to be the best guy. Now, what makes you a good coach yeah. is it doesn't mean it may, because you're from that country. But if your style of coaching is to dive into and making a, con- a connection with your players in some way, right. what better way to make a connection with your player on your national team to say, hey, yeah. I'm th- it's, this is it's, our, it's, it's our country, country right? It's not, not necessarily, necessarily because you could have a guy that comes in with a crazy, with a crazy system yeah. that just works, and, and you don't need to pull those emotional strings yeah. as often, or from that perspective. Right. Everybody has their own yeah. thing to say. It has to be from that country. That's hard. It just happened that all the players that he was, yeah. you know, if you notice, Klinsman was trying to replace all those older players. Uh-huh. He was trying to get away from yep. the American-born yep. right. and the American players that played here and grew up in the sport here. And he was trying to go find those yeah. European, those American play, you know, those American. Uh, I, I still think Howard citizens from being born overseas, right. yep. and are on a military base or whatever, and they grew up playing that Tim, European style of soccer. Tim Howard's got to lead this team. I think uh, you know, uh, there's no way around that, uh, and he's got to lead the team right to the World Cup. You know, like Joe, Joe joined this and he said, you know, you got to be, you know, it's all about putting the right, be able to put the right, the right players together. Yeah. Combining right. the right uh, players, yeah. right, right personalities. Yeah. Right players yeah. for the right, for that system. All right, let's jump over to the women's side. Um, um, they just finished a tournament also, uh, not so great, although they did have a great comeback against Brazil. That was an awesome game. Right. That was an awesome game. Yep. Uh, yep. Again, I like seeing... New faces. Mm-hmm. They're trying some new things out. And you have faces. to, right? They have to. Um, you didn't see, you know. But but now, all right. So they didn't win that tournament, right? Who won that tournament? Dude? I don't think it was anybody. It was uh, four games. There was no. Fi- fi- I don't yeah, know somebody, celebra- somebody, somebody top, celebrated. Somebody celebrated it. I, maybe. I, maybe. Maybe. No, it was Switzerland. Maybe. No, I don't know. No. All right. Whatever Australia, the case was. Australia. Australia. There you go. It was they, Australia. Points. Um, U.S. I think they won Brazil it. Brazil and. And they beat the U.S. for the first the time. One that, what's the other team? Japan that was there. Japan. Japan was there. Right. So anyhow, the U.S. plays this tournament. New players. Uh, I like Kristen Press. I think she's stepping up big time. She's getting a lot of playing time now. Mm-hmm. Okay. So and she's scoring goals for her club team also. So I look for her to be. One of the leaders, you know, yeah. 
Morgan. It kills me, it kills me that Megan Rapino had such a big hand in that comeback win. Yep. I just don't uh, like another her. another another great. Yeah, but another but great player. Play. But as a player, yeah. which is what it's driven on right. and guided by, she right. led that charge. Yes, she did. She led yep. that charge in all the games. I think yeah. she she played well in all. Now, now where I'm going with this is. Um, I'm th I think you. I, were, exactly I think I think you know where I'm going, which is pretty good. You read me a lot, so should Hope Solo be back on this team? She has to earn a spot. Okay, that's fine. Give her she a shot, a and spot. she'll and she will earn it. Um, you know she will. Not just not just as a player, she needs to earn trust and and respect of her teammates back again. Um, she served her six months. Hey, listen, that's it. It's done. But now you got to come back and earn absolutely. that trust you, back. Right, absolutely. you got to um, come in there. you got to compete. You're not just, you're, yeah, you're Hope Solo. But mm -hmm. you're not just Hope, hope Hope's back. Yep. See you later. You're out. No, See you later. no. It's easy to say that. You know, I honestly think had Ashlyn Harris not get hurt, that's why, okay. what's her name, uh, Nair was in goal. Okay. Yeah, Ashlyn yeah. Harris would gave have up, been the start. Gave well, up that some. One goal, Brianna yeah, yeah, actually sat yeah, there and said, Are you yeah, kidding? The yeah, ball hit her yeah. in the hands. Yeah, she if, fumbled it right, right in. Right yeah, hands. Yeah, yeah. Um, yep. But it's going to be hard. Gonna bring up call, call her back in. Now, she hasn't played. She's playing back with Seattle. But she hasn't been playing. No, of she's, course not. No. She's not. She no. hasn't earned the starting because job she's been touring. Yeah, well, she's been touring yeah. her book and right. whatever the case. But she yeah. has. So now, trying to get the her starting fan. job back in Seattle first. Right, right. Which actually, the goalie for Seattle, Hanley right. Kopmeyer, right. has been the, playing really well. The problem. Take that position over, then maybe they'll look. At the you problem with this is, if you have a hope solo in your camp, it doesn't matter if it's a national team or your club team. How can you not play her? You know she's going to get into that lineup sooner or later. Well, then let her earn it back in. Though. She'll earn it. She's going to get in. So whatever get club, oh, then not you, then you get back in. Right. You you've done your you you did your you paid your cent you right. paid your, your dues. Right. right. Now it's time. Right. But now. And the only way she loses it is if she gives up the bad right. ones. Right. That's how she's going to lose it. Or but she comes on to a, a team. Stupid does stupid do it again. Right. Do right. Right. Again. Well, yeah, you hope that. You hope that the, not. The, the you hope, hope you learn. Look, I'm looking. I'm looking at it long term. I'm but looking listen, for the World Cup. I'm you, looking at her for the listen, World Cup. But listen, you piece it together. The whole thing, that whole, this all wasn't just this one thing. This built up with her and her husband yeah. still in the van, yeah. drinking and driving. Yeah, with yeah, the van. absolutely. And this, that. Yeah, you know, we just spoke about the pretty boy doing that stuff. Right. We, girls look up to her. It's true. The same, you know, but girls. You know what? Look, it's also it shows you just because. You, you do something wrong, right. you pay the price, right. you, you suffer the consequences. Her yeah. consequences were you were out of soccer. S six months. Six months. Right. You know, yeah. she then chose to take it even further and yep. not play. Well, she quit our club team right. and all that. Yep. To get right. her life right. together. Right. And Which is good. You need it. That's fine. Sometimes maybe she needed that. You need that. To, to but charged. now it's also the sign that needs to be taught to, you, to the kids is that just because you might have been the star here. Right. And this all happened. Doesn't mean that you paid your dues. You come back and say, "I'm here," and you go back in again. No, you need to no, earn no. Your time. So no, she'll earn it. What? Go back. Put your time in at your club team. Put the work in, so that when Jill Ellis makes the phone call or the visit to your club to right. see you training, to see what you're doing, or makes the phone call to your coach yep. and the other and then, trainer, hey, what's she doing? How, what's her mentality? Her, her mental state like? Right. What's her, her work ethic like? Does she want it bad? Well, she, she needs to watch some games. Jill's got to watch her, well, her but play. But you also got to talk to the people. Right. What's she like right. in the clubhouse? Right. Yeah. What's she like yeah. with the, the, the other players on right. that team? Has she well, matured over that has, yeah. You know, is that is that stuff behind her? Right. Is this, and listen, I'm not going to I'm not gonna lie to you. If you give me the choice, yeah. you know, I'm putting her in there. She's <laughs> you got, got experience. you got to put her in there. She's yeah, got yeah. the experience. Yeah, yeah. But show me yeah. that you're ready to come back right. and play. Show right. me that you're at game ready listen we're building towards the world cup on the women's right. side so now time, which is a year you know, yeah, you know like a year and a it's, be, it's you, know, you know 28 2017 is pretty listen, much done it's a year away it's a year away from russia right we're a year away from russia for right the men's for the men's side right on the women's side forget this year because there's nothing else going on yeah. for the women's side so they well, have one start, year start later on this year start the they may have another maybe another tournament no, maybe they'll start they'll start 
end of this year, probably beginning of, next, of January, they'll start Quali their, their qualifying. Their right, qualifying right, form. right. And you need to have, you need to know who your keeper is going to be, right? Right. Well, so. they still got time. Yeah, they, they got no, they got time. But if she has her head on straight, I think she's going she to she, she's going to be the keeper. Right? Yeah, keep yeah, yeah. And if she really wants to, Joe said it right. She's a nut, but you gotta you can't be a hundred percent normal if you're a keeper. No. And I that's why I look. He's a keeper. Yeah, we well, know it. Yeah, yeah. My daughter, you know, you can't stand between two pipes. The problem and say, is shoot no, the ball at me. No, you're right. And be normal. And coming you at you, right? <laughs> you but can't. but this is her last shot, also. Oh, this is it. Right. So so you want to get this right, hope. Right. All right, hope. If you're watching, I don't know if you're watching, <laughs> yeah, sure. but really get this thing no, together. This is it. You get it together. Right. This is your last shot. Right. You're gonna win a World Cup. This you is know, it. I and I believe in her really playing this on the field. It. So all right, women's side. Anything you wanna, else? You want to touch on? Well, your, I, you know, I your, your, listen. Your, there's only one standings going on right you now. You want to touch on your surging NYC? Actually, no, not really. Listen, it's not about. They're four points. It's guys. not. They're four points out. It's not about. the supporter shield. Again. And you know what happens when yeah. teams in this area. You can have it. And, and this team can have it. You know but what you, happens when they win the supporter shield. Listen, it's not about New York City beating the Red Bulls. It's not about that. It's about winning the MLS Cup. Well, that's it. The long haul, right? Listen, if we beat you guys two out of three. Yeah, so I'll take, I think, we're, I think we're playing again next weekend, right? That's all right. Are we this weekend I don't know. coming up? To be honest, you might be. I think so. Yeah, I think that's it. It's really not about the the rivalries and stuff like that. It's it's getting your team ready to make that run in the playoffs. Well, that's it. That's it's real. Hot at the right time. You know what? This table really doesn't matter to me. You're they're in that green shaded area. Like I this said, is where you want to be. How many ML? How many supporter shields have they won? Well, New York has won uh, at least one, two. I know of two. Okay. And every time. And it means nothing. It means nothing because they've gotten If they were in the Europe, or second if round. you were in Europe, you'd be making big money. Right. But over but here, over it means, here shit. means nothing. Right. Because in our world, right. yeah. you got to go to playoffs. Right. In the United States, right. And in the U.S., soccer, they change the rules. They, they eliminate the overtime. They have this playoff format. Anyhow, so what's your take on this MLS season so far? Uh, let's go right up to the All-Star game, which was a couple weeks ago, right? And you know what? The first half, I was bored. I'm yeah, like, yeah, yeah. And, and the girls were sitting there. We were watching it, and the girls were going, Sabrina, yeah. uh, Brianna just, she wasn't paid, but Sabrina's like, Dad, they're really holding their own against Real Madrid. They're, they're holding their and, oh. and I don't know if it was that Real Madrid was just tired because they'd been playing their world. They were doing they their the, International yeah. Cup yep. World Tour. You know? So, George, Get did you here. watch the game? <laughs> uh, all right, so I can't, I can't ask. You. Then I can't, I can't ask you. So but wait, now you'll get mad. So I watched the second half, and it's coming near the end with like eighty something minutes left. I yep. said, "Game's over. I'm yep. going to bed." Yep. And that's the end. I find out it's, they tie it up, yep. and they go to and they lose it on PKs. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. "You gotta be kidding!" Again, me. why even go to PKs in, in, with that type of a game, an All Star game? It's an All Star that's game. A, what? It's a joke. It's a joke. They're, they're the laughing stock. This, uh, you know what? And they were gonna expand. Miami. Is there an MLS? Is there an All Star game in in Europe? No, they yeah, don't play. Is. You well, know what it's Super Cup. No, you want to know? UEFA <laughs> no. Champions League. Oh, it's be, it's a lot better than a. <laughs> but that's, but that's the yeah. Games we get. Yeah, but that's a lot more high. No, better but soccer. Point is, yeah, we yeah. want an extra game. Right. What do they do? Right. Throwing an All Star. No, game. no, yeah. No. I'll, no. I'll, so I'll now pass. they're playing an All Star game. Most of these teams are playing in the U.S. Open Cup. Yeah. Then you got your league. Then you. How many more games? Uh, listen, um, it seemed to me that that All Star game where Real Madrid was just just playing relaxed soccer, right? They, they were toying. They were with toying them. Exactly, they were toying. They with weren't them. playing relaxed soccer. If they want, even, it seemed like if they wanted to, they would they would have scored like four they goals. They came out the second half. And they yeah. it, all of a sudden, yeah. Zidane must have been like, guys, enough of this already. I'm embarrassed. Go out yeah. there. And they, yeah. and they turned it on. Boom, boom, boom. Next thing you know, there's a goal. And he had the nerve to tell a reporter that, oh, MLS is really doing well. It looks like that's a joke. Come on. No, because they paid him a lot of money to come over and play. Okay. You, they had to pay the money to come Of over. course they did. Of course they did. But, again, uh, uh, the laughing stock of soccer, the MLS, and I'm sorry, I have to say that. It is. Guys might not agree. It's a, it's no, my no, opinion. Listen. But they are the laughing stock. But it's a, but it's American. But but it's what we have promoting the sport here. Yeah. You oh. know that, that there is no other. 
There's not nothing else to watch unless no. you and, I'll, and I'm going to watch. Like and you're right. watching Deporto, yeah. well. Deportes, and I'm watching well. the Pumas play Exaca, and these lunatics are running around down in Mexico playing yeah. soccer left yeah. and right. Yeah. And it, but it's but guess it's what? fascinating I, soccer. Guess what? I'm I don't going. Know what they're saying, I'm going to see the Cosmos. Know. I'm going to see the Cosmos Saturday night. That's all. You know. That's it. I'm just going to go well. see. Because I'm not even going to get him in trouble because I'm sure somebody from the Cosmos is no, watching. No, 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 no. Now all of a I'm, sudden he's a Cosmo fan. I'm just going to go there because oh, the tickets the tickets are a nice, good price, you know, and uh, it's close by. It's close by. Well, is that's it somebody uh, affiliated with you that it's Yeah, with yeah, Cosmos that's stadium? fine, but I, I've gone before that. Yeah. Uh, you know, the last game I was at was on uh, on the 4th. Right, So, right. you know, Listen, it was it's a, close. It's, it's, a, it's like more of like a family night. It's nice. That's it's a, a nice atmosphere. Do I, we were on the field. The field was terrible. The field. It's a, is it AstroTurf? Yeah, but it's 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 square. Obviously, it's, it's like a, but it's horrible to play on. It's horrible. We were on, I was on it. You know, so not a good not a good turf. But uh, again, that's all they have for now. Were Hopefully, they out, were they giving anything out? They give out like Cosmo fans. That night, with Raul's face on it. No, something? that night they, the fourth they gave out. Uh, they gave out, yeah, they gave out uh, Shark Cats. They oh, they gave out like, Shark Cats? It was Shark Week or something uh, oh, like that. Oh, Shark Week, so they gave out Shark Cats. I think right. they were giving out fanny yeah. packs with yeah. Rolls face yeah. on it or something. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, look, uh, maybe they'll get a stadium. Maybe we'll get rid of the Red Bulls somehow. We'll take, they'll take well, over that well, let's stadium. Let's see. Let's, let's start this now. Who's going to have a real soccer arena first? Yeah. The Cosmos or the New York City FC? Well, let's let's hope let's hope New York City has a, an arena, but that's no. At least uh, the Cosmos, they're playing in a baseball field. You might say the field conditions stink. But the field but is the actual, yeah, field. right, right. Not, it is, it know. is, it is, yeah. Well, but the field itself, not good. I don't think. Just my opinion. Well, I but from from watching the game, yeah, you're looking at it. I could see the seams and you. The seams. I thought it was at first. I thought it was sod. Yeah, like they no. came in and they no. laid sod over the whole field, but so, then I, they said some kind of turf. So yeah, and I think they rented that turf from another somewhere else also. But we won't get into that. I'll have the source actually come on and uh, talk about uh, that. But again, it, you know, I don't know. They don't, don't even know. they don't sell out. The stadium's not sold out. So you know. again, it's just but a fun know, night out. You know, that's a great spot to get to. I mean, it's not far. You know, it's a good thing. Oh, yeah, we got about a minute 40 to go. So, you know, next week we'll be live in Studio A. So we'll be back in that studio uh, live on television. And, uh, you know, that's about uh, it for now. Joe asked me to, to, he's been chiming in. His cousin from the Bronx joined on, Lena. Okay. So he said yep. just give her a shout out. So thanks for joining, Lena. Thanks for watching, Lena. Enjoyed it. We'll be back on next week. Next week. Next week. Next Monday night, seven thirty. I start my third week, my third day of practice. All right. Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. Okay. Th wow, three days, huh? Oh yeah. All right. Big time. All right. We'll see you guys uh, next week. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'll probably be here for next week. Most likely talking pro soccer and uh, whatever. It yeah, because there's not much there's more. Re there's really nothing. There's not much to talk about. Oh, we'll we'll have some fun. September. Oh, George is going on vacation. We'll see George in a, in a few weeks. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll talk for now. Yeah, we can. MLS stuff. And, uh, yeah, I'm there'll be stuff going on. Because now, now the Premier League started this past yeah. weekend. So Didn't mention it, but Body won the first two games under the new regime. Okay. All right, Copa Italia, they won the first two games. So that's a good thing. No, not yet. This is a cup game. This Cups. Yeah, this, this, the season and style. This doesn't count. When it gets to, we got to worry where it gets yeah. to. But they won two cup games, which is big. So now, we'll talk about yeah. that later week. on the next week because I want to hear about this new coach. All right. Well, uh, we'll see you guys next week. All right. Take care, everyone. Thank you. Bari nel nostro cuore, non ti lasci.